Hey everybody, it's Rory from ANS Gear, and we're gonna look at some elbow pads from Dye. So these are the Dye Protective uh, Compression Formed Arm Guards. These are actually, uh, were originally designed for a snowboarding uh, arm guard. So um, a lot of the features that you'll find in it are really for protecting you when you're snowboarding, but since the, the padding is so similar to a paintball padding in design and in layout, you could wear them for paintball as well. So we're gonna talk about them kind of as a paintball guard or paintball uh, elbow pad. Um, but their true design was originally for snowboarding. So you can see how that kind of crosses over, how they're involved in both platforms. So it's got the padding that you were typically or would be comfortable with seeing from an elbow pad. So it's got a large elbow pad section right here, forearm pad that goes down the bottom, nice soft uh, padding that's gonna sit right on your elbow. One of the differences that you will feel with this elbow pad when you put it on is the padding that is on the back that goes after your where your elbow sits, it sits up a little bit further than you would see it in a normal paintball elbow pad. Now, I'm assuming that's for if you were falling from riding in a pipe or riding on the boxes or rails or whatever you're doing, you might actually fall and hit the back of your arm more often than you would in a paintball scenario. So the padding sits up a little bit higher, which, you know, a little extra padding is not gonna hurt anybody. Coming down the bottom uh, down here, this section right here, they have a piece that, let me refer to it properly, it's called the Bone Saver Core High Impact Protection. So there's actually a hard plastic plate that sits underneath this foam piece uh, that will, if you were to hit something that had a sharp edge to it uh, or slam your arm against something with a, a sharp edge like a box or a rail or a pipe or the lip of a, um, of a snowboard half pipe, uh, you could actually break a bone hitting something like that that hard. So there's actually a hard plastic plate inside there that would protect you from that. Now that is covered with a foam, a soft foam on the outside. So in a paintball application, you still would get some bounces, um, but you definitely get the most protection possible of getting shot there and uh, being protected from bruising or anything like that. Uh, so I'm gonna put this one on real quick so you can kind of see where everything sits. Uh, getting down to the bottom side, you see this has a really long, um, I guess, wrist cover. And you'll see that or why that's there once I put it on. So I slide this all the way down. I'm going to pull this up on my arm here. Make sure I can get into the frame here and you can see that there. So again, the padding on the back side, it really comes up. This is like halfway up the back of my arm right here. So padded on the back. Nice gel spot for my elbow. I feel that that's nice and comfortable so I can feel it against the table right there. Good mesh venting through the back. Nice hole right there for articulation, for bending. This kind of uh, strap that goes along the uh, backside here to keep it in, in place and keep it secure, it is on a bit of uh, elastic so I can wrap it around there and tighten it up. A little bit more protection, that gel, the same gel that's on the backside of my elbow right here is on the inside of my forearm. Now for paintball, Probably never going to come into effect, that section right there. But it does act as extra padding, so there's nothing wrong with that. Now this section right here, um, in snowboarding, you're typically wearing a longer glove that helps keep the snow from getting up your sleeves. Um, so this would be kind of the same thing, help keep snow from getting up underneath your elbow pad, um, keeping you nice and like, dry and comfortable. Plus your jacket will probably be over the top of that and your gloves would be over this. So it kind of creates that barrier between your skin and the snow to keep you from uh, just being uncomfortable. Now, translating that into paintball, this will keep dirt, debris, sand, mud, whatever it is from getting up under your jersey um, or uh, getting up, if you're wearing gloves, from getting inside your glove uh, and just keeping it off your skin. So keeping you a little bit cleaner and keeping you a little bit more comfortable during the day. Now this bottom section, this does not offer any padding or anything like that. So this is just kind of a sleeve to help keep the elements from getting in. Um, it's definitely not a paintball pad, but it could work as a paintball pad. Um, so it's it's comfortable, it's tight, it's secure, and the padding is definitely there on my elbow. It's just lacking some of the padding in different places where you would normally see it for a paintball pad. But uh, definitely the application is the same. So check them out if this is something you like. Maybe a, you know you call it a, a half glove or a half pad. Um, they're available through the website. They come in a couple different sizes. <coughs> extra small, which would be a youth size, small, medium, large, extra large. Um, they're called the uh, Dye Snow Arm Guards. Check them out on the website. Order yours now through ansgear.com.